There we go. Okay. So it comes with a fair amount of hardware because there are these little connector pieces for each of the panels. It also comes with some clips as well as some nylon cable ties. As well as a very cute small hammer. And that's it. There are several packs of these that we have plenty to put together. Oh, and I see some little white clips here. Okay, so looking at these, each one of these panels will be connected to the other ones. Looking at them, they are not uh, bending easily. I'm putting some, some pretty good pressure on them because I want to make sure that they are sturdy. Um, and they seem to be good. And then these are the inner um, panels for the shelving. So they do, they feel pretty sturdy. I think that, you know, a cat of decent weight would be able to uh, be comfortable on something like that. And then the next thing that I'm gonna look at is instructions because I want this to be easy for everybody. I also see, it looks like we have a mat for one of the shelves, like a liner. Oh, that's very cool. It's a uh, it's a cat hammock with a Sherpa type material on one side and a minky fleece on the other. And I love the zebra print design. I think that that's adorable. Okay, so looking at this. Um, it gives you multiple different ways to assemble it. You could put um, a roof on some of it, a roof on all of it. Um, you have the panels to play with, so whatever makes the most sense for you. Um, they show you how to hook them together using those little uh, round pieces that I showed you. But like I said, it is very modular, so it also gives you a lot of flexibility depending on the animal that you're making this for. Do you need a floor? Do you need a ceiling? How? What makes the best sense for your particular use case?